went to the PA ball, obviously, and then come here. What did, what did you want to show them today that maybe you, you didn't get to show in game uh, down, down there? Uh, I just want to show them uh, my routes were, were crisp, you know, my hips were smooth. I could get in and out of my breaks real smooth, um, catch the balls, really run anything on the route tree. I'm not limited to outside receiver or inside receiver. I can real versatile, can move around. So this is the main thing I want to show. When you talk about your journey and all that you've gone through, is it nerve wracking that it, it, it doesn't all come down to today, but I imagine it could feel like everybody's mm -hmm. watching me now. Is, is there nerves that come into today? Um, it's definitely nerves that come into it, but um, you know, being at this level, uh, I've trained myself, you know, to handle those nerves, and I got different techniques, you know, to deal with anxiety, uh, meditation, uh, breath work. So, you know, I just stay, try to stay grounded, stay in the moment. Your catching and stuff in particular, how'd you feel like that went? You said the catching. Yeah. Oh, it went real good. Um, I said I felt my like my routes got a lot smoother. Um, looked pretty smooth on all the catches, you know. You ball everything, eyes to the ball. It was good. What's that, uh, you know, going to feel like whenever you get your shot with an NFL team? Um, man, that's a dream, you know. I've been dreaming about this since I was six years old. So just, just to live in that dream is going to feel surreal. But um, I'm super blessed just to be here. And for any opportunities that do come my way, I'm super blessed. And I won't take it for granted. I'm just grateful. I'm going to do all I can. Was there any doubts, you know, getting to, to this point here with the, the injuries and everything? Um, I feel like it's always it's always doubts that creep in. But to me, it's about uh, knowing how to handle those doubts. You know, having faith in God, that's the number one thing for me. So that pretty much eliminates all doubt to me. Um, I don't have any doubts. You're supposed to say for team growing up? Dallas. Dallas. Yeah, that's where I'm from, so okay. the Cowboys. Did you like uh, seeing them here in attendance today? Yeah, most definitely. Yeah. Whenever you're about to take off for your 40, you're a guy mm -hmm. known for your speed. Is there pressure on you then? And at what point did you know, okay, this is this is going as planned? Oh, uh, yeah. So I've been training for 12 weeks, you know. So, like I said, it's not any pressure. Um, I don't believe in luck. So, I put in all the work and just for this day. And I, I felt like I was ready. So, it wasn't much pressure. Take a deep breath and get it done. Have you, have you kind of mentioned you're able to play inside? Is that something you'd be interested in? And Talk to yeah. teams about that. Yeah, most definitely. Um, every team I've talked to, you know, I'm a guy. I'm, I'm not limited to anywhere. I can I can return punts, return kicks, inside, outside, special teams, gunners. So wherever they need me, um, I'll be happy to fill that position. How oh. important is it to stress that to to people let to let them know that mm -hmm. you're not afraid of doing whatever? It takes. Uh, it's super important to me, man, because I just I just need an opportunity. You know, like I said, I'm a grateful dude. So whatever opportunity I'm presented with, I'm gonna get my all. Have you heard any feedback from any of the, the scouts? Uh, any things to you know work on between now and draft day or anything like that? Uh, the main thing was just staying healthy, you know. Um, staying, staying right on my diet, taking care of my body, making sure I'm available. That's the biggest thing. So, so what's next for you? Where do you go from here? I'm um, going to head back to Houston, continue to train, you know, stick to my routine, keep working out, keep staying on my diet, and um, hopefully get some opportunities, meet with some more teams, and see where it goes from there. Anybody impress you today among your teammates? Um, I'll say really everybody. Jason, um, uh, CJ for sure, Lamont Bishop, Sione, Brock. They all impressed me, man. Uh, I've been playing with them for years now, so it's just it's just an exciting moment when we can all come together and have a day like this. You know, a lot of guys don't don't even make it this far or get blessed with this opportunity to get here. So um, I'm just super proud of those guys. There's a stigma maybe around long snappers and their athleticism, but it seems like yeah. it seems like Matt's pretty athletic. Is that something nah, you guys knew going into this? Super athletic, yeah. I've been knew Matt was athletic. Uh, I was telling uh, one of my friends earlier. Um, I saw him in a game, you know, snap the ball and run all the way downfield and go make a hit on a returner. So like I knew then, you know, he got the speed, he got explosiveness. Like you know, he's probably the most athletic long snapper in the um, in the country. So 